Can I go with a two two choice? Can I go with a Fulham win or tie? If not, I'm leaning towards a tie in this one. I'm leaning towards a Fulham victory here. Although Fulham did lose to Everton two weeks ago, one nil. No. Everton another relegation threatened side. Uh, so we'll see. Fulham have lost a bit without Mitrovic, but Brentford against Villa. Ollie Watkins traveling to his to his old to his former team. And I would say he's going to go there and haunt them and produce the goods. And I think Villa is going to win this one. Yeah, hard to see anything other than a Villa victory here. Crystal Palace rejuvenated under the oldest manager in the league, Roy Hodgson, causing Everton. Similarly to the Fulham Leeds one, I'm in between a draw and a Crystal Palace win. Again, with the home side. But, again, having to choose one, this time I'm going to lead for the home side to come out victorious. I will probably go for a draw. Lastly, Leicester, who are deeply in trouble, hosting Wolves. Again, another tough one. Like all, all of those are just, except for the Villa one, is tough. This is why the Premier League pick them is so. I mean, the, the prize is fifty k, right? It's insane. It, yeah, like yeah, seriously. Yeah, that one you have to guess every score right, right? Yeah. <laughs> Could you imagine somebody? Has anybody ever won that? Uh, I've seen some very near close ones. Uh, you know, the last game of the weeks. Um. You know, they, they tell you how many people are still left and what the score needs to be for them to win. I've never seen it personally whenever that's popped up. I don't know if there was. So we'll see. But this What's game, it? yeah, I mean, I, I, just, I think Leicester are in trouble. I think they're going to suffer another defeat. I'm leaning towards that draw, to be honest. Fair enough. And I lied. That wasn't last match. Uh, Bournemouth. Fresh off of a, a great victory at Tottenham, hosting West Ham. Such a tight match again, yet again. But I'm leaning towards Bournemouth. Yeah, same as well. They've impressed me last week. There's there's very few games because of the, the three of the Premier League sides being involved in the FA Cup action. That's all we have time for today. Guys, thanks for tuning in as always. We hope you enjoyed your time with us. Remember to subscribe, to leave comments and share with your friends. Follow us on social media at FOTBPod. Don't forget to leave a review, rating and most importantly, don't forget to turn on those notifications. Join us again next time as we discuss the highly anticipated upcoming Premier League action. Thanks again as always. See you then.